Thank you. Ollie, you can sit down there and come to you. <laughs> My legs get me there. Juan, two seconds. I know you're breathing, but had an, an you don't have time to tweet now. You can tweet afterwards. <laughs> um, you had some epic rallies going on there. It looked like a real battle. Yeah, I know, but he really deserved to win. I mean, he played very well. It's my first match of, on the year on grass, so I think I, I did well, but 
He was better than me, for sure. Nice. I mean, today is your first match on grass. I mean, this is a good practice for Wimbledon, right, next week? Yeah, for sure. It's a good warm-up. Maybe I play tomorrow, one more match. So it's going to be very good for me, for my game, to get more rhythm, to be ready for the Wimbledon. Um, do, you, do you get pre-match nerves going into a big tournament like that? No, I mean, I have like eight years playing on tour already, so got some experience, but also I get nervous, but not like the beginning when I was uh, young, but now, you know, I get nervous, but a little bit, not so much, I say. <laughs> and let's talk about your Twitter fetish. My Twitter fetish? No, no, no. Not now, please. <laughs> Who's your favorite person to follow on Twitter? Uh, Andy Murray. Could be. Yeah, and the, <laughs> no, kidding, kidding. Uh, Sam, I don't know, Sam's basketball player from the US, LeBron James, Dayan Wade, I don't know, some guys from sports. I love that you're into your social media. Is it big in Argentina? Uh, yeah, a little bit. I, I don't know if here, bigger than here, but it's okay then. And have you been watching the Euros? If I'm watching what? The football, the Euros. Euros. Yeah, of course, but I'm Argentinian, you know support Messi very much. So, you know, let's see. I like Spain. Spain, Germany, could be. UK, obviously. UK okay, could be. They play t tonight. They have stuff to throw at you, but... Yeah. Okay, England. Let's go for England. Come on. Well played today. It's been a pleasure having you here. And good luck for women. Thank you very much. Tuan Monaco. Tuan, if I take a seat. Well done. Thank you. A round of applause! What an incredible match. I mean, you must be feeling, you know, you, you came out here, you pulled it out in front of this crowd here, feeling confident? Yeah, you know, it's, it's a good little boost before Wimbledon, and, you know, it's my first Wimbledon, so, um, you know, I need every little bit of help I can get, and, yeah, um, after playing like that, you know, I've definitely taken a bit more confidence. Now, you won the US Open in the, in the juniors. How's, been, how's it been the sort of transition into the seniors? Yeah, it's difficult. I think um, almost having a decent junior career, the, the older guys want to beat you more because they think, you know, who's this young upstart? We'll teach him a lesson. And yeah, so it's, it's been a tough couple of months, but, you know, I'm starting to, starting to see the rewards. You see, Andy Murray won the US Open, so you've got to be thinking, that's where I'm headed, Andy? Um, yeah, I mean, Andy's an amazing player. He's number four in the world, and he's a great role model and someone who, you know, I'd, I'd take his career because, he, you know, he's had, I'm sure one day he'll win Wimbledon as well. So. Uh, now, not just a very talented, sorry, just injuring the tennis players, uh, a very talented tennis player, but you were also a child actor. Yeah, a long time ago. Uh, you know, I really enjoyed that, but, you know, tennis is always what I really wanted to do. But, yeah, it was, it's good because it gave me a bit of experience of sort of doing things in front of big crowds, so I think that's helped. I was Googling pictures of you. You've changed quite a lot. <laughs> yeah, I was pretty young then. I was probably about 11, and I was probably a little bit chubbier than I am now. So. Well, I didn't want to say anything, but, yeah. Um, <laughs> Not, obviously, joking. Um, now, you, you, you're currently sitting at 485 in the world, which is pretty fantastic, seeing as you only, turned, you only came into the seniors this year. Yeah? So what have you got to do now to get your ranking down? Um, I've got to start winning, winning more matches, I suppose. That's really the only way I've got it. That was one of my final questions. <laughs> um, no, yeah, um, sort of making the transition between the lower levels and now starting to play some of the bigger tournaments like Wimbledon and some ATP events and start doing well in them, and hopefully my ranking will go up. We think that you are star of tomorrow. Oli, congratulations. Brilliant win today. Round of applause. Oh, fantastic. Good luck for Wimbledon. We're all rooting for you. Juan Monaco and Oli Golden. Right, well, that's about it, guys. Thank you so much for coming down today. I hope you all had a fantastic day. Um, and it didn't rain. Hurrah. Um, and uh, if you are lucky enough to come down tomorrow, we've got a fantastic order of play here as well. So, uh, and if not, we'll see you next year. Thank you very much. Oh, and ball girls, congratulations, because it's been really cold and you've done a sterling job.